So tell me this, Simple Abundance sold 5 million copies in the United States, another 2 million abroad, 7 million copies. Uh, were you getting at least a dollar for every book? Were you getting at least that? Yeah. Probably yeah. more. Yeah. So you don't have to tell me everything, but did that, was that heady for you? Oh, yeah. But you know, there, there, there was this little the ritual then in publishing when um, the Times list for the next week would come out and on Wednesday and you'd get a call at 6 p.m. and they say, you're number one again. Really? That's and it was fun. like, oh my gosh, mm -hmm. you know, uh, very heady, mm -hmm. you know, have a glass of champagne. And yeah. that went on for almost two years. Really? Yeah. And then How came- How long were you number one? I was number one for almost a year. Wow. Yeah. And, and, and it was on there for like 119 weeks. Wow, yeah. that's amazing. It is amazing. But what I wanted to share with you, and I've never shared because you don't get much sympathy for this, the Wednesday that there was no call. Mm -hmm. I thought, oh, that's sort of strange. We haven't heard from the <laughs> New York Times today. <laughs> we haven't heard, they haven't, yeah. they haven't called. And so I called my agent. I said, I haven't heard anything. She said, well, you're not on the list this week. How was that? <laughs> that. I cried. How was that after I 119 weeks? I cried. Yeah. And I thought, I thought, no one in the world will understand what this feels like. The only trouble with being number one is eventually you have to be number two, yeah. three, and four. Because yeah. life moves on. It does. Life it does. On.